we had a very specific freight problem here in town. Um, we have a route that's very, very critical that we were looking at. And there were several other freight projects that were going or getting ready to start in the state. So we started looking at a freight priority system. Um, now, there are a lot of points that uh, people can jump on here, and uh, I'll, I'll get to talk about a lot of those. Uh, the freight priority, what we're looking at is uh, we have a Mercedes-Benz factory that's in Vance, Alabama, around milepost 89. And there's a critical supply chain that comes through town, through 26 signals, out on the freeway. There's a lot of construction. And we were looking at reliability of vehicles, and not just freight necessarily, but that was just one application. The neat thing is, is that you'll see that this actually extends into transit quite well that we're looking into, or other vehicles. Um, so with that freight system, what we're looking at is what can we do to improve the reliability of that just-in-time, just-in-sequence delivery while minimizing delayed drivers. Um, so I've had uh, one of a grad student, Sufi and Teluctor, and also of two research engineers, Vi Lidby and Elsa Tedla, um, and also a colleague, Travis Atkinson. And we've been working on that for over roughly a year now. Um, and that's something that we've been able to achieve as far as helping vehicles get through the system more efficiently while minimizing delay to other drivers. Yeah.